session. This guy, you know, even in friendly, Zero likes to try hard. He is a really dedicated champion. So let's see what goes on here. This is game one, winner semifinals, IQHQ Vinny versus TSM Zero. I wish the crowd could hear us so I could ask them to cheer because I know they would be blowing up right now. Oh, yeah, man. So Zero obviously going to go ahead and start with his Diddy Kong because this is the character he decides to use this matchup. Uh, even though, like, it's widely considered that his main has been switched to Sheik, but he, you know, for this matchup in general, he's gonna go with the Diddy Kong. You saw him do the work uh, at, at Evo with it to go ahead and take uh, Evo, or to go ahead and win it over Mr. R. And so now we're gonna see if he can get the same work on Vinny. Vinny starting off very nicely though, 53 to 15. Ooh, oh, just and like zero. that, man. He's starting to bring it back. Yep, finding just a little bit of momentum. Gonna try to carry that as far as possible. Oh, and his footsies game is so good. I think it's one of Zero's biggest strengths is that he's an amazing boxer. He loves to go for those down tilts, the safe forward airs, mix in a grab or a jab where necessary. And it's just hard to actually fight this man face to face. But Sheik, very well equipped for the job. Oh, yeah. A smart, smart option right there by Vinny, by the way, to come out uh, to jump out of shield with that neutral air instead of uh, spot dodging. Because, um, Zero ran up to him, I guess, expecting it. So he jumped out of shield, neutral air, hit the backside, and then crossed him up. So he landed on the other side. Very smart. Great, great spacing and awareness right there. So kind of an even game right here on, on percentage, uh, which kind of it's kind of bad for uh, Vinny because uh, I mean like you're, you're even on percentage, but as, as we always like to say, she you know a little bit of a hard time killing. Well, uh, especially in this matchup, right uh, against Diddy Kong, who has like four or five different ways to kill. You know, exactly. So. Yeah, I feel like uh, even though the kill power for Sheik is it's you know it's there, it's not ridiculous, but yeah. her weight and survivability is going to be her downfall as you see zero convert into the first kill right there. Certainly not anything Vinny can't come back from, especially because Sheik has the advantage of being able to gimp Diddy Kong very yeah. effectively. Yeah, if, he, if he ever forces Zero to recover under stage, like, that's probably a dunk stop. I feel like Vinny is not going to be the one to hesitate to drop down with the neutral air, you know? Right, absolutely. And he has practiced this matchup in and out as well in preparation for this very day that he gets to take on Zero. Oh, going for some down tilts. We actually saw Kakujin convert into a kill off that at the higher percents when down throw and forward tilt wouldn't quite do the job. Right. So, but now Vinny just kind of getting beat up on the second stock. Oh, it's looking worse and worse as time passes. But keep in mind, this is the first game. You could definitely see things turn around, especially with a Vinny counter pick available. Okay. Oh, looking for the grab right there. Kind of just waits it out. I think. I think. Zero is starting to uh, call Vinny on his spot dodge habit. Uh, he has been spot dodging a lot whenever he feels like he's in trouble. And uh, I feel like now he's getting grabbed on quite a bit. Like Zero's just kind of waiting it out. Zero looking for the anti air right there. Oh, that should be it. Mm. Finally gets himself a stock, but at 109, is it, is it too little, too late? We will find out. Yeah, I mean, I would never count Sheik out in this kind of position just because of that offstage game. Yeah, the game potential right now is real. If uh, Zero does not mind his spacing, he could end up getting uh, carried off and then immediately gimped at Even a low percent. So. Even off just one simple grab or oh. forward air. Could this be it? Oh, oh wow. Vinny. He had a great. fair. It was a clear uh, position to go for fair and not bouncing fish. Nice, perfect pivot for spacing. Catching nice. the roll. Oh, is that it? That's it. Mm, yeah, that's going to be it right there. Good stuff. Once again, zero confirming off down tilt into up smash. For Taking that, that game one. All right. Very solid stuff from both players there. We could see Vinny had his moments of shine. But Zero was just keeping it solid overall, making sure that he took every confirmation very, very far. Also, oh, shout out to Zoo and crowd. More melee heads. Good stuff, man. That cross pollination is only going to benefit both scenes. Oh, yeah. So we love to see, man. Yeah. Dude, all Smash games. Like, if, if it's got Nintendo characters beating each other up, I'm down. All right, so we're going to switch over to uh, Final Destination. This is Venus counter pick. I'm going to assume maybe he thought the, the platform was kind of messing him up uh, quite a bit, which. Honestly, whenever I see Zero on uh, Battlefield, he does seem to be able to... His movement seems to be a lot better, you know, like with the whole B-reversing and, and, and weaving in between platforms and whatnot. Pretty also, uh, Diddy Kong from underneath the platform is really scary with that up air. Yeah. Super quick, and with Zero's execution, you know, he has, like, those frame-perfect uh, short hop fastball aerials. Super scary stuff, man. But Vinny may be trying to neutralize a lot of that here on Final Destination. Great escape from the combo by Zero, though. Only took one forward air at only 49. That was... That's impressive, D.I., man. Oh my god, man. Vinny is having a hard time with this matchup right now. Managed to get himself a back air to Bouncy Fist confirm and tried to beat that uh, monkey flip out with another Bouncy Fist. However, just a little too late on the, uh, on the draw right there. Yeah, uh, Zero able to stick the kick out, which is really uh, such a dangerous option for fighting against Diddy Kong. It's like, oh man, he can do this command grab, but also he can cancel into an attack with a lot of active frames and lots of range too. Oh, Vinny going for that kind of greedy 50-50. Let's, oh, very smart. New Zero was going to sing on the way down. Oh, but all of a sudden, this juggle situation reversed on him. Bouncing Ooh. fish to escape. Very nice. Nice. Ooh. So he caught him that time. Uh, Zero throwing out a hitbox. 
instead of air dodging, but it's still enough for him to uh, be stuck in lag and falling straight in to the uh, vanish. Good stuff right there by Vinny. Vinny uh, escaping the invincible Diddy Kong from Zero with a couple rolls and then shot the full load of needles right in Zero's face, and Zero was able to just drop shield into forward tilt. That was like, hmm, how is he going to punish this is what was going through my mind, and then beautiful way to do it. Oh, all right, double four throw two. Bouncing fish tries to get another bouncing fish in there. Oh, wow. That low Very profile, uncharacteristic man. Of, of Zero to be missing punishes like that, though. Right. I mean, he could at least turn that around. But he still gets it right there. Another down tilt to up, up smash, man. That's like his favorite confirmed now. Actually, I think it was because Sheik lands in a heap after Bouncing Fish, and she's like kind of on the ground a little right. bit. That low profile saved him from the up smash. But yeah, still very uncharacteristic of Zero, for sure. He usually knows every situation the optimal punish. Right. So maybe Vinny's getting in his head just a little bit, but oh, he's no bringing it back immediately. Wow, the instant throw from Vinny. That was super nice. Just take that banana into his own possession real quick. The repo department. Definitely. I need that. <laughs> you haven't paid your bills. Oh, All right. Got it. Ooh. Got another banana yet again. Immediately grabbing that before he even hits the ground. So, Vinny. Nice back air. Oh, into oh, the bouncing, bouncing fish. fish. Is this the start? No. Vinny overextending quite a bit. And oh Zero was God. ready. Oh, jeez. That Smart. was close. That was very close. Smart by Vinny to just be so slightly below the edge after the hop that he was able to get the poof and not eat that down air. Oh, looking for it yet again. Oh, wow. wow. Again, a little Where's low that? profile action getting a zero out of punishment. Ooh, throwing hands. Everybody throwing hands right now. Hey, good stuff right there by uh, Vinny. I mean, he threw that out. He, I guess he was looking for the grab, so he just threw out the jab to cover that option in front of him. Only two little hits, but enough to stop the, uh, the oppression. Nice catching Zero's roll in with the needles and repo on the banana again. Vinny working for the, the city, I guess, man. Yeah. Okay, great forward air out of shield. Okay, okay once again. Going to get off this? Nice. Yeah, fair, that's going to do it. Vinny, taking a page out of Zex's book, man. Yeah. The down throw to immediate, fair. Immediately fair right there. Like he, He's been uh, he's kind of conditioned for it because the last few times he was near the ledge, he, he did go down throw vanish. So he kind of conditioned him for that. I was like, you know what, man? Like, you might not want to air dodge. <laughs> Maybe. Flat. Might be a good idea not to. But, uh, yeah, man. Just You could see the cycle of conditioning between these two. They're just like, okay, here's what I should be doing. Or here's what I want you to think I'm going to do when I pop you up in there. And then all of a sudden, completely change it up on you and get a stock. But Zero is going to stick with Diddy Kong. Counterpicking to Dreamland. Trying good to get choice those low ceiling yeah. platforms. Yeah. Trying to get those platforms back into the mix. I mean, he won that uh, first game on Battlefield. Pretty dominant. So. Yeah. You know what's kind of a rough uh, factor about this game, man? Because Battlefield and Dreamland are both legal and both, uh, you know, three platform stages. You can just go. Oh, he has no jump. Oh, oh close. Not enough, yeah. If he he had, like, tried not, to wait it out, I think. Yeah, if he had wall spiked him, maybe. But then Zero could have just teched, so. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, I, I just think he should have banned it. I mean, like, Zero already won on Battlefield, so he can't go back unless y'all agree on it. So he should, if he didn't want to go to another platform stage, this is the last thing he had to do to ban. Right. So. Actually, no, it's best of five, so I don't believe uh, oh, there's no bans? DSR is a thing. Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh, no true. DSR. Right. Not really sure, though. The Smash 4 rule uh, is still kind of being ironed out in like, the finer details and stuff like that. Yeah. Oh, very obvious. So Very smart. obvious right there on the uh, air dodge and immediately getting punished for it with the nice up smash on the top platform. No way he was living that. I mean, when you're fighting Zero, it is only instinctive to get a little bit scared and go for those maybe hasty air dodges. But yeah, I feel like Vinny could have and maybe should have known that was coming. Either way, he's just going to shake that one off. All I'm saying is that's, that's how Zero won Evo. <laughs> yeah, I, exactly what I was thinking. I was like, oh, that's so reminiscent of what he did to Mr. R. Oh, the down air. Nice. Vinny with a lot of tricks in his book, man. Okay, 45 down. I mean, if he closes the stock out soon, it could be looking good for him. But again, just every percent counts, especially when you're fighting this guy right here. Every percent counts. Every time you get an opening count, especially against Zero, man. Because he, oh my god, right over the edge. And he caught Vinny's tricky little B-reverse needles away to maybe reset that juggle trap. But Zero looking real sharp in that third game of the set. Okay. Possibly one more to go. Possibly two. Let's see what Vinny's got. Okay. Just going to check the stages or something, I guess. Look yeah, at, I guess so. Look at these guys' faces, man. They are so focused right now. I mean, this is Vinny's chance. This is Vinny's chance to really, like, make a name. Well, honestly, he's already made a name for himself. This is Vinny's chance to really be like, look, Vinny, and I'm here to stay. All I'm right. one of the top threats in the world. I mean, already thinking Game Off Zero proves a lot. but Yeah. And it wasn't even, like, a, a cheesy game. It wasn't, like, Zero SD. It wasn't, like, you know... Rage kill or something stupid like that. He just you know? played right. Yeah, he just played right. Kept it solid the whole time. That's why he's not sponsored by Team Liquid, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> nah, uh, just kidding. Shout out to Team Liquid, what? though. Whoa, I didn't know you could go here. Let's go. 
Interesting choice. Interesting choice from Vinny because yeah. I don't think you – like, you just got body on a platform layout. Like, I, it's, I wouldn't go here. I mean, if anything, maybe Town and City, you know? Like, so at some point in time, there is no uh, platform. Yeah. I don't know. And they, they haven't went to Smashville, but maybe you got uh, Shruck, Shruck if there are strikes. Oh, no. no. Oh, that is – so unfortunate. That's why I hate this stage, man. I, I really don't like Meverse because of that. That lip is murderous, and that might have just shot Vinny's chances of beating Zero. Yeah, I mean, he, he doesn't even look that. Like, I just saw the look on his face. It doesn't even seem like he wants to play anymore, but honestly, you gotta you gotta shake that off and just keep going. Yeah, you do. You gotta have the heart of a champion, man. Here we go. And we've got some hype in the crowd for him. Alright, someone's starting a Let's Go Vinny chat. Starting to get echoes and more and more people in on it. Let's see maybe if this uh, spirit bomb kind of crowdsource hype is going to work. Wow. Or, uh, Zero's kind of immune to that kind of stuff, though. Yeah, I feel like he's probably used to it by now. Oh, man. Wow, getting scooped up. He's trying to, get, trying to jump out of that one. Not fat. <laughs> that grenade wow. is running off. Okay. This is still possible, though. If he is able to close the stock out and he just plays super clean once Zero spawns, could be... Could be a reality, man. We could see a game five. Nice. Okay. That's all right. That's, that's one. one. That's one. Just one more. Yeah, very nice right there. Confirmed. Needle into uh, bouncing fish off the stage, and he's carrying him. Oh, oh man. The Thirty-six. And recovers high. He's trying to. You know, I think he. I think he knew he was gonna do that. He started, started trying to carry him to the other side. Should be real smart. Got to oh. maximize that damage. Vinny. Vinny, even with an SD at twenty percent, still looking good. Oh, nice. Runs away from the banana toss. Oh, good this, trade. He's, he's in this, man. Yeah, he's it, in it's, this. It's doable. It's all of a sudden, it's it's a possibility. And he's that SD, out a way to get down. That SD definitely motivated him to just play out of his mind. He knew it was all or nothing at that point. Oh, and no, that's going to do it. and that's oh. going to be it. So unfortunate. He had the hit, but it was a jab that landed behind him. Yeah. And so for he ends up getting down to the up smash. Great stuff. Man, great showing, though. Honestly, man, like... He looked like he had given up, then he started to play with he's you know, he's playing out of his mind. That was a, that was just a really good play for me. Even with one stock down, he managed to bring it back to an even game and just uh couldn't clutch out the last hit though. Unfortunate for him that he all, had to do that all all of one stock though. Definitely a little bit of pain in my heart after that one. I can't can't lie. You know, can't hide this, man. <laughs> <laughs> the IQ so, HQ baby. Yeah. Oh man. That was uh that was a great set though. SD aside. Zero really showing why he's one of the best in the business, man. He always will complete. He will not drop his combos. And that's so important. A lot of players in this game, you know, because of how freeform the combos are in Smash, and also how dynamic things are, like percent values and rage and all that stuff, it's very easy to have a confirm and not take it all the way. But Zero always does, and I think that is one of his most powerful assets as a player. Yeah. In addition to, like, a high gameplay speed and great neutral and all it's that.